On the banks of the Kafue River, instruments are monitoring surface water flows and groundwater levels. Engineers from WAMA guide a delegation from the China Institute of Water Resources and Hydropower Research through key monitoring sites in the area. Apparently, the country needs 300 stations for effective monitoring and management of water. Currently, we are standing at 80, 80, 80, 87 um, groundwater monitoring stations, uh, some of which are monitored uh, using semi-automated gadgets and others are man manually monitored. Monitoring stations are actually uh, monitoring the availability of the groundwater fluctuations in the rainy season and in the dry season. We know that during the dry season we don't receive any rainfall, so mostly what happens is, is groundwater flow movement as well as groundwater obstructions. So that tends to lower the water table. The visit to these sites is crucial for China IWHR in understanding real water challenges. Wama says the goal is to modernize Zambia's water observation systems with modern technology in order to improve operations and service delivery. We're going to be looking at long-term planning. We're currently also working with uh, updating our national water master plan. So these processes and assessments and modeling will help us do that. Apart from that, we will improve and increase the efficiency, uh, moving away from the traditional technologies, uh, moving away from manual reading. We're going to make steps to ensure that there's more telemetry, more remote sensing, and more um, utilization of ICT in the real sense. And also we look forward to getting, improving our equipment. The China IWHR has concluded the visit following a partnership with WAMA to strengthen the management of water resources in the country. Kasabulam Chimba, ZNBC News in Kafue.